March 27, 1513, Spaniard Juan Ponce de Leon and his expedition make the first sighting of land in Florida. 1613, the first English child born in Canada is born at Cooper's Cove, Newfoundland. 1790, the modern shoelace with an aglet, that's the plastic stuff on the end, is patented in England by Harvey Kennedy. 1794, the United States government establishes a permanent navy and authorizes the building of six frigates. 1841, the first U.S. steam fire engine is tested in New York City. 1855, Canadian geologist Abraham Gesner patents kerosene. 1884, the first long-distance telephone call is made. The call went from Boston to New York. 1915, Mary Malone, also known as Typhoid Mary, is arrested and returned to quarantine on North Brother Island in New York. She spent five years evading health authorities and causing several further outbreaks of typhoid. Her reasoning? She didn't think she was contagious. 1930, the first U.S. broadcast of a radio signal from a ship to shore takes place. 1952, Singing in the Rain, the musical comedy directed by Gene Kelly and Stanley Donan, starring Gene Kelly and Debbie Reynolds, premieres at Radio City Music Hall in New York City. 1970, Ringo Starr releases his first solo album, Sentimental Journey, a collection of pre-rock standards. 1980, Mount St. Helens becomes active after 123 years. 1998, the Chicago Bulls versus the Atlanta Hawks. A matchup at the Georgia Dome in Atlanta draws a crowd of 62,046, the largest in any game in NBA history. The Bulls would win 89-74. to These are just a few of the things that have happened today, March 27th in history. This has been Mr. Scott with Today in History. Thanks for watching.